Okay, look, I mean, this 3D thing has to stop now. I've tried to look at it. I've tried to be very calm about it. I've tried to be very relaxing about it. You know, Double H is normally a very calm, very quiet guy, like um, a pigeon, you know, which are very quiet animals. But, you know, I mean, this 3D thing is getting stupid. I just watched the Yogi Bear trailer. First of why they're making a Yogi Bear film. I mean, I used to watch Yogi Bear, you know, as smart, you know, smarter than than the average bear, which is a phrase that I still use, you know. Um, so first of all, like, why are they doing it in CG? Why? What's the point? Money grab, obviously. But then again, afterwards, in this sick, sick commercial capitalist um, over advertising, let's sell the face of everything age that we're living in. What do I see at the end? Yogi Bear in 3D. Saw 3D. Everything is, I mean, everything is now in 3D, but the the thing that gets me is like, this is a much bigger thing right here, you know. This, you know, I mean, this is just showing that the art of film is getting even more lost now. Like, the whole artistry and the, cre and the creativity of film is getting lost, you know. Um, because now it's like the, the three thing it's a cell because what does 3D mean? it means IMAX what does IMAX mean? Um, a lot much more of an expensive ticket per head and that means bigger profits so people want to now take people to the IMAX to see this in, in 3D and as we've seen with many things like Clash of the Titans and Last Airbender 3D ain't looking good because the guys who are using this 3D don't know how to use it in the way that James Cameron knows how to use it, or how experienced filmmakers like Spielberg or Ridley Scott will know how to use it. So, at the end of the day, it is just a money grab, but I think it is too much, and this is just the perfect example of the kind of movie age that we're living in. You know, but, pe but these studio people don't realize that, realize that people are smart enough. I mean, obviously, People like I to I to be ignorant and dumb. That's just the way that, um, people have always been throughout history. But people are a lot smarter now in the internet age, the age of information. Even when you read comments, people are a lot smarter. I mean, they they are a lot more aware, um, as JCVVD would say. You know, they are a lot more aware now, and people they can see they they are calling it out because they're look, looking at wait a minute man we're, we're, we're still in a bit of a recession here why am i going to pay more money it's first of all to watch a bad product but on top of that a bad product presented badly i.e in 3d which is not even fully in, in in 3d you know so i mean but hollywood are just showing that they don't really know what they're doing and where the, and where they are going you know, it this just shows that they don't, that they're just like, whatever is, is the new thing. Okay, Nolan made um, um, X million for TDK, therefore he should do Superman. Um, Avatar made almost three three billion, um, and three billion for him from Fox with the whole three D thing. Therefore, everything must be three three D because if we now use three D like um, Avatar did, did, then therefore we'll. Um, make three billion but they don't understand that and what they don't feel to see is that it goes back to the talent and they just don't want to admit that because they feel that everybody wants to take a shortcut everybody wants the, the easy book everybody just wants to find the easiest route to making the profits that's some that, that, that avatar made or that dark knights made you know um but, i mean but you know sticking with this whole 3d thing is like you look at um avatar like james cameron the guy he's it takes time okay this, this took up like a decade of knowledge going under the sea to do that whole titanic documentary that that, that, that he did you know it took time you know louis Le Le leteria he's a guy he's a guy from the streets you know he's a guy from the streets of france what does he know about filming something in 3d pro properly i mean does he really know the uh, equipment in the same Way that James Cameron does no, all right no. So I j I just think that you know this is extremely bad 
um, morals and ethics, personally, I, I feel. Because, you know, not everybody is on the internet. Not everybody knows the, 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 the filth that is behind this whole bombardment of 3D, you know. And these people, obviously, with their families and everything like that, will go and say, oh, in, in 3D. And therefore, they will go and pay more money and they realize that really they've been giving a, a, a false product but oops money has already been spent and so i mean i just think that i mean i feel, look the the 3d fad it's, it's it's dying okay it's dying because there have been too many flops they've been, they've been just way too many flops and people are saying that really they're just slapping 3d on just to take your money it's like that's things like they they just people are just desperate to take your money and we've lost the age where the, the director sells the film, the quality of the director sells the film, that you don't need any bells and, and whistles. People will watch a Spielberg summer movie. People will watch a James Cameron summer movie. People will watch a Nolan film. People will watch a, Tar a Tarantino film. People want to see what Aron Aronofsky is doing. People want to see what Fincher is doing. You know, I mean, Gone, Gone is the age where, like, you know, a good trailer is a good trailer. You don't need to say in 3D, if a trailer is good, that's it. It's good. People will go and watch. You see that Matrix trailer. You see that. You see the Matrix Reloaded trailer. You go and watch the film. Like no questions asked. No questions asked at all. You see that Matrix Reloaded trailer. You watch the film. And so people say, oh, they were not really good. But at the end of the day, look, man. The trailer for Reloaded was the film, and more. You know, the the trailer for Constantine was the film. You look at the trailer for Constantine. Personally, I liked it. I thought it was an amazing trailer. I watched the film. It was a very, very good film, which was the M trailer. So I did not, I did not feel cheated. But obviously, sometimes it, it, it happens. But again, it's like, you know, it's the quality of the advertisements and the advertisements advertising you the product in and of itself. You know, 3D, this, this whole 3, 3, slapping on 3D thing, that has nothing to do with the film. You know, at the end of the day, you're going to sit down and you're going to watch um, what has been written down in the script and what has been presented for this whole Yogi Bear thing, which is, you know, I mean, I'm hearing that Timberlake is boo-boo. I mean, you know, so that's the thing, you know, like, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, when, when you're watching Avatar, People can say, okay, it's a simple story hand there, but it is still a quality product that is executed well and by a guy who knows what he's doing. You know, but so yeah, man, I mean, I just think that, you know, what, you know, this 3D thing is, I just find it very, very unknown and I find it very, very infu infuriating because, um, I can't even say infuriating, bloody hell, infu infuriating, bloody hell. Like, but basically, I find it very annoying. You know, I mean, I hate people forcing things down my throat personally and i think that pe other people should, should should feel the same you know and i think that people need to, need to just call out this whole 3d thing and suggest that like it has to stop okay let me choose what i do with my, my my cash don't tell me to pay more money for a product that is rubbish and that sucks okay clash of the titans 3d it sucks last airbender 3d is one of the worst films i've ever seen in my life the Yogi Bear thing, I watched the um, trailer and it doesn't look good. It just it just doesn't look good. A total complete waste of time. You know, I'm a big fan of Dan Aykroyd, eighties, eighties. Look you look at the at that trailer for Yogi Bear, it's rubbish. So I, so who cares about th in three D? No, it's rubbish. So this whole three D stuff, man, it needs to stop. It really just needs to stop because it's just getting very annoying now. Alright, peace.